the Age of Triumph. What is it? Well, it's the last live update to Destiny 1, and it's coming out on Tuesday, March 28th. The update is like the old Moments of Triumph, but mixed with the April update from last year. But this update, this time around, is going to bump up all the old raids, so Crota's End, Vault of Glass, and bring them up to 390 light, with updated gear, updated encounters, and a new book to kind of encompass everything that we've done in Destiny since the beginning to now the nearing the end of year 3. And almost every page has a page-specific emblem that you get once you complete the nodes of that page. So there's a raid portion. Once you complete all of the nodes for doing whatever you need to do for the raids, you will get a special emblem commemorating that you did that page. So you'll be collecting things like ships, or doing things like going flawless in Trials of Osiris. So the first page was for veteran players. They wanted to give something out to the players who have been there since the beginning. So if you played in Vanilla Destiny, you played in House of Wolves, Dark Below, and so on, you're going to get a special emblem for playing in those during those times. If you didn't, well, that's too bad. And since all of the old raids are being brought up to the current light levels, there will be a new challenge mode for them. Two new challenge modes for Vault of Glass, for Crota's End, so for example, Vault of Glass is now challenge modes for Atheon and Templar. The raid section of the book requires the completion of all nine ch different challenge modes from every raid. So King's Fall, Wrath of the Machine, and now Vault of Glass and Crota's End challenge modes need to be completed. You'll get, you know, the emblem that comes with that. And what's the biggest thing now is that they are coming with updated gear. And not just, oh, you can infuse the old gear and you get them and it's... No, they're actually putting new ornaments and different style of the gear from Vault of Glass or Corsand to all that stuff. Even, like, Wrath of the Machine and King's Fall, they're going to have ornaments. You'll have a second ornament for siva flying your SIVA armor and all that. Very little has changed in the raids themselves, so for Vault of Glass, pretty much nothing's changed. Maybe slight little brushes here to slow on the time, all of that. Nothing big there, but Crota's End apparently has some big changes to it. They didn't share what those changes were, they were changes to hopefully fix the problems that Crota's End had. Since the raids are being upped, their loot tables need to be adjusted. Back in the day, the loot was so scarce during those, and so now they need to update them to be more generous, so we're going to be getting better loot drops. The book then has a page dedicated to each class, so Titan, Warlock, Hunter, if you main a Warlock only, you're probably going to have all these done. But they required you have, like, melee kills in Crucible, super kills in Crucible, reach level 40, do each of the Crucible quests for each of the separate subclasses. Crucible and Trials both have separate pages, but what's really important about Trials is that you don't need to complete every node to get the Trials-specific emblem that comes from that page. Every reward in the book is an emblem. So if you absolutely love emblems, then this update is just going to be a field day for you. Lastly, the last reward when you rank up the book fully is a promo, an offer, for a specialized t-shirt that has the logo of the Age of Triumph and your gamer tag on, like, the sleeve. You still have to buy this, this isn't a free shirt, but, hey, it's pretty cool, you know. It's not that $7 billion t-shirt or whatever if you didn't get that thing from a couple months ago. The last thing, Bungie made it perfectly clear that we do not need to complete the entire book. We only need to complete three-fourths of the nodes in the entire book and we'll still be able to get all of the rewards the book levels give. So you can still get that promo t-shirt if you don't complete every single node. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, hit that bell if you want to see more. And have a great day.